see Monte Pig Latte from Evolved Living. I've never been a marijuana smoker, so I found it prudent that they sell legal, some kind of form of legal marijuana called Mr. Nice Guy. Supposedly it's a form of potpourri. Maybe it's Mr. Nice Guy from uh, Half Baked. We're gonna try this and probably become Mr. Nice Guy potpourri because marijuana prices have become rampant, just running rampant. I found out. I asked around and done my research. It has a very high pitched potpourri smell. So very high pitched potpourri smell. It's just I mean very high pitched. But we're gonna go ahead. Ooh, it's got some twig twigs in it. Like some sharp ass fucking not just cut through your paper but actually fucking hurt your finger while you're breaking it down for type of stems. So you can buy, you're not just going to take it out or think you're just going to start going to smoke it. I mean, it's not bad. Of course, if you smoke stress, you know. I've heard. Uh, there are no seeds in this at all. There is some kind of stone, though. Kind of pebble, some kind of not but but hard as hell not breaking up it's not so i'm going to begin to try my first hand at rolling something oh i have some uh, patch just in case i mess up but if you know me you know best that i don't fool around but if this smokes good and does something to me possibly gets me high and i may become a mr nice guy smoker we have somebody at the door. I'm gonna go in there right quick. Try to start setting up. Yeah. Join my dad on Art with Big Mike. Big Art with Big Mike. Join my dad on Big Art with Big Mike. Isn't it cool how I can say stuff like that and edit later? I have a collection of these that's so grand. I have like 500 of them. Do I uh, promote or condone mind altering substances? Absolutely not. Do I participate? I drink occasionally. Ah, uh, the fans on. Y'all can't hear shit. All y'all can hear that. Hey, well, we're gonna turn the air on and the fan off. Tanya, yeah. you do me a favor. Can you turn this fan off. All I can, I'm, we're gonna be able to hear in the background is this fucking fan. And shit like that in this world for some reason loses you cool points on the YouTube. Turn it off. Yeah, and turn oh, on the yeah. air if you can. But you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I can see it now. What's that annoying fucking hum in you guys' background? That's one of you guys' comments, so just don't even leave it. I'll put it up there for you. See, I was thinking about that earlier, like how you can use logic to start to fucking literally anticipate and predict every single thing. Like, if you lost your keys, but you can come up with like the super relativist idea of where they would be logically, you should be able to find your keys even if somebody else got them. Because once Occam's razor, once all logical explanations have been exhausted, it might just be possible that somebody got up on your keys somehow right in the transactions of you doing whatever you do. So I believe logic can be used to become telepathic. <laughs> like I've been reading people's minds lately. Not reading people's minds, but reading people lately and practicing that. And I've been doing very well. To where if somebody asked me and noticed that that I was reading them really, really good. So, it's just uh, more out there. More out there to, to, to find out and explore. More to come. More to come. We are, it, we're supposed to be able to do our thing. Like We shouldn't have to work in your system just because you think we should or because you want to. <laughs> we, as free human beings, supposedly, should have the right not to participate. Y'all are motherfucking making it like mandatory to play y'all game. To the point where or even the people who are losing in the game are like, oh nigga, you better uh, stay up on your paper. You better get that dope pimple bitch, nigga, rob a bank, nigga, get whatever, do whatever you gotta do to get your dough. And when you put it in context right there, you're just like, well damn, if you can't, if everybody, every single person can't make money in the system legally, then this is the wrong system. 
I mean, that's just, if you heard it right there when I said it, if every person can't make how can, that's, that gives a person the reason to be fucking shysty. Yeah, I noticed you noticed my muscle. Look at that shit. Like, wow. <laughs> Shut up. We're about to take our first puffs of Mr. Nice Guy. The legal marijuana supplement. <laughs> Where the canaries in the coal mine, the guinea pig. <laughs> I smile. My body has a reaction. That was my first reaction. That nasty to that taste. Not at all. It's very, uh... Ooh, it's very smooth. I can hold it in, that's for sure. Come on, I'm not supposed to have a tail. You like it? The way it tastes? Yeah. Salvia? It reminds me of salvia, I guess. It has a very light salvia taste to it. You yeah, haven't tried salvia? She might recommend it. I don't. So I mean, not to everybody. I mean, try I it once. Like, it. I would, like I would do it. Again. Try it. Uh, it's cool. It just makes you feel like <laughs> like you're hallucinating. Like you're so hallucinogenic and just a fucking beyond a hallucinogenic. My skin felt like it was melting off. As soon as I did it, I started drooling. And like, you're dying, you're dying. If you didn't know, Savi and this is legal. Damn, that was a rock. It meant my tongue. You motherfuckers that get on YouTube and be showing them smoking all types of crazy shit. It's crazy. And my nigga Bling, I love you damn. But I still have a family to take care of and care about. Check out Bling Bling's uh, videos right there, right over here. Yep. Got some funny shit there. Uh, Bling's bungee jumping on crack. But this is Evolved Living and you're spending time after basically not stop recording damn near all weekend. I got some on the john, I got some in the shower, I got some of me and my cousin Sorinda, my brother and I, Ty and I, my brother, I mean Destiny and I, just everybody. It's just me, a lot of your boy out here, and just a lot of that Evolved Living. Even though the chips are kind of down right now, which they really aren't, we still are holding our own. We've been maintaining and doing our thing and haven't been needing any help from anybody, so. That's hella cool. That's hella cool. We're not all rich, so we gotta make do with the chips. And then try to uh, play them. Especially when you're not cheating. When you're cheating, it's easy to win. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When you're cheating, it's hella easy to win. How do I reach these kids? It's kind of hard to get across to. What I'm to say. I actually kind of just forgot everything I was saying. Do you remember what I was actually talking about? <laughs> I remember you said it. Cartman. I know right before that, I guess that took me. What was that about? It was about uh, cheating. Cheating, you motherfuckers. Look at her, see? Oh, yeah. Cheaters. Cheaters. Yeah, everybody, you know, motherfuckers be cheating. And then winning and then be like, I got dollars, motherfucker. Like, yeah, but you did it like illegally. And then it's okay, because even the bankers and shit do it, and they win. So I understand that this exists, but because it doesn't have to, I find it morally offensive. And socially redundant and stupid. Half the motherfuckers don't even understand what the fuck I just said. And the people who do don't do anything about it. Like they still play the game. Like Anthony understand everything I just said, but he'll still play the game because he knows he's still evil. I didn't ever want to play the game. Ever, 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 ever. I didn't want to play. <laughs> Monopoly's good enough. You feel high? I feel super. Like not high, high, high. Like it's a weird high, but I'm definitely high. It doesn't feel like I'm high though, but I know I'm high. I got the fucking feeling. 
I'm doing a product review right now. One thing about this Mr. Nice Guy is that it falls apart. It's like it's, some of it's kind of hard, and it falls out of the cherry, and it's that's lit. It's like fucking little comets and asteroids. They had it right for your fucking meat, and it burns cool too. It's not burning funny too much, and it's it was cool real fun. And I'm pretty fucking high. My, I'm a high in a way that I haven't never been. So, and I'm not saying like on some lightweight shit. It's just a different type of high. So. Check us out, Evolve.